All right, welcome back to Fiesta Friday, everybody. The members of the Guam Women's Chamber of Commerce are holding their first golf event. And to talk to me about that right now is attorney Vanessa Williams. Vanessa, half a day. Half a day. All right, this is the first thing, as I said, you guys are putting on. How has the planning been before? Because, you know, golf tournaments, we have them all the time here, but uh, logistically, they can be a pretty big job. Yes, um, logistically, it seems it's pretty intense, and, I, and everybody's got a little small part. I mean, we just started off last September, so, you know, we're a baby organization, mm -hmm. and, you know, we were ramping up membership, and, you know, after we had laid down what our objectives are, what our vision was, and then we were like, we need to raise funds, you know, to achieve those objectives, and we're, you know, a lot of ideas came across the table, and then we are like, it has to be a golf tournament. You know, everybody loves playing golf on this beautiful island. Um, it, you know, they do well, you raise a lot of money, there's always great prizes. Um, so we we basically went for the gusto. We're like, we're gonna do the biggest, most difficult thing we can do as our first fundraiser. Go but, big or go home. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Nice. Okay. So, yeah, but we have a whole team of people. Um, we actually have to have Mr. Bill Rages, who's been critical in the support. Um, yeah, I, I know he's like the golf tournament expert, and he's been re uh, really helpful with the committee and planning it. Um, we've got some powerhouses like Roxanne Garrido Chang and Joanne Camacho, who are, you know, really good at, they've coordinated golf tournaments before. So we, you know, we had some bit of a, fundraising institutional knowledge so that really helped too but at this stage of the organization everything's a team effort mm -hmm. so everyone's doing their little thing um, I mean even just as small as securing a few sponsors and all of that well very nice with the, well with a golf tournament being the case uh, what course is involved what courts yeah. um, the are you talking about uh, the course is the onward golf resort Let's nice. see. onward yep. telefofo golf resort I'm not a golf mm -hmm. golfer so well, you I probably will be by the end of this. Yeah. <laughs> and, and being, being a, a event coordinator, you're probably going to make your way around the course at least six times. Yeah. I, well, I, would, I wouldn't once. call myself the event coordinator. I'll be more like um, drink person, uh, food <laughs> person. But yeah, I'll, I'll be there on the course at the Onward Telefofo Golf Resort. I, I've been there before, I believe, for one other golf tournament, and it was gorgeous. Also doing the drinks and the food and, and helping with the coordination. Oh, very nice. So, yeah. um, how can people register? Um, well, you can download registration forms online at guamwcc.com. Um, you can also pick up registration forms at the Toure Cafe. It's off of East Agania. Mm -hmm. um, golf USA, uh, Onward Talafofo, the, the, the golf course, CCP, uh, Windward Hills Country Club. Um, I, that's all I can think of off the top of my head. But, you know, there's different places between, you know, Central, I guess, Golf USA and Toure would be your best bets mm. and certainly people can contact the guam women chamber of commerce for more information and, yeah. yeah and if they email us you know um at ed at guamwcc.com or just check out the website and get the information there we will get their registrations in fantastic Good. yeah so on that note how is the women's chamber of commerce going right now and if people are interested women obviously um how can yeah. they how can they join and what do they expect to have in terms of networking and in terms of you know opportunities okay well guam women's chamber i mean our we're we're a business league you know our we're a bunch of business people business ladies and we have some male members too so far you know we're equal opportunity everyone can join um but really the the goal or the vision behind the guam women's chamber was to promote you know the overall economy by the equal participation of women in business commerce and trade um and so as a member, and membership fees are, I, I think, are are pretty pretty affordable um, for an individual. They're like a $100 for an annual membership. With that, you know, you have our quarterly meetings. Um, sometimes we do special monthly meetings. We, um, as a member, you're eligible to for health insurance and in, under the Guam Women's Chamber Group. Um, you also get access to our affinity rewards. We have an affinity program where you can get discounts and um, incentives with various retailers, um, services, and um, restaurants. Um, I think even furniture. Um, so there's there's Very all nice. these little perks. I I, th I feel like the health insurance was really big to us. You know, to provide another group for those who, especially like small business owners or you know solo proprietors who are just starting and need you know that network. In addition to the fact that you know we meet regularly, we support one and one another, have speakers, you know, mentoring programs. All right. Well, we got to go to commercial, but can we get the website once more? 
Yes, it's guamwcc.com. All right, Vanessa, thanks so much. Okay, thank you. All right, come back anytime. All right. All right, stay tuned because we will be right back. More Fiesta Friday after this.